Hello, vlog. This is Elias. Here we go. This is going to be my first trip to Atlanta, Georgia. Dropping off Cameron at the airport at 7 a.m. on Thursday. Uh, today is Wednesday. I'm leaving at 10, so we'll see how that goes. I've never been to Atlanta, so hopefully we do some cool stuff. I know the aquarium is there, but I'm not allowed to go without Marley, so we we'll to find something else to do. But we'll figure it out. Poop emoji. Nope, I meant to give it to you. I need air pauses when I don't have All right, so welcome to the freaking vlog. Me and my little sister, Alexis, me and Elena, Dale. Ew, it is oh, it's on right now. See that little red button? That means it's on. And as we are on our way to Atlanta, Georgia for the second time, I suppose. Apparently I forgot the first time. And we're gonna be vlogging the entire trip. Alright, so Cameron's afraid of heights, so let's just see what we're dealing with first and then put him out where I'm too close, too close. And then put him where he's at. Yeah, so is that like 40 feet, something like that? Easy peasy. 40 feet, brother? Yeah, 40 feet. Easily 50. Okay, fine, easy 50. Either way. Uh, you have to lean over a little bit. Uh, oh, welcome to Atlanta. Yes. It's another bridge there, right? Sure. Um, so we've already passed what the the Coca Cola, uh, Coca -Cola. world of Coca Cola, the aquarium, which is literally next door to it, which I, I'm gonna go back with Marley one time, and then um, the Chick Fil A the, the stadium or something. We passed the, uh, Braves Field, I think I missed that one. But our hotel is about 20 minutes down from downtown-ish. I guess this is downtown Atlanta. Um, we're about to go to Centennial Park where I guess the Olympics were held a couple years ago or something like that. We'll see, you'll see, you'll see. You're about to see, watch. Got him, bird. All right, so we are in downtown Atlanta area. Um, there's, if you look straight, I'm gonna show you here in a second. Right over there, there's the, uh, over here is a freaking Ferris wheel. And then straight over there, you can barely see it, is the Olympic rings. I guess the Olympic was held here um, a couple years ago, like 1990s or something like that. So this is my first time downtown Atlanta. Um, but check this out. Uh-oh. <laughs> Do a flip. But yeah, and it's just cold enough that I can finally wear my jacket. The only thing I regret is not bringing a freaking, um, a freaking hood beanie. And this guy's doing something over here. I don't know what he's doing. Oh, mom's gonna try. Let's try this. First or so you're gonna have to give it a push start, and once you give it a good enough push. This is your go, this is your break. Down? Yep. Like, hey! It no. does, Humble. it does if you like push it down real hard, but you want to ease into it, so give it a good push and then press down and then you start. <laughs> don't fall. And don't crash. <laughs> Slow down then. Oh shit. Rest <laughs> in peace mom. <laughs> That's where I want to go. Bears <laughs> Anybody 
Whitey down there, but the poster said that it was open. So we didn't get to do too, too much, but we did get it right on the Ferris wheel, which is pretty cool. Get a different sight perspective for Atlanta downtown and all the lights. And I think they're doing some kind of a Chinese New Year thing. We didn't get to go into it because it cost money and it was super duper duper long line. How long were we waiting for the Fer uh, Ferris wheel? 40 minutes? Probably like 40 minutes. It felt long, but we'll see. But uh, we're gonna go to the hotel now. And, um, and then get dinner, and then I guess that's it for the night. And then bring Cameron to the airport at six in the morning. Probably. All right, we'll see you there. Can you get the trunk? Alright, so we just stopped at a place called Crog Tunnel in uh, Atlanta, Georgia, on our way out of the town. Um, and we found this place called Crog Tunnel. I think I just said that. But essentially, it is a, uh, I guess, an artist are allowed to graffiti or do their art here and stuff. And there's a bunch of really cool stuff, and there's a lot of it. I thought it was just like one wall, but um, it, it, it's like, I don't want to say a mile long, but it's definitely a lot. So I'm going to try to show you as much as I can, but I mean, it's pretty cool though. And everyone can like, I guess, write on the wall and then they can tag themselves and stuff. So this one's from Thought the Fisher. Some pretty cool stuff though. And I think, I could be wrong, but I think um, on our way in, someone was actually painting on the wall already. So maybe we'll see it live in action. But uh, look some more. This is a fire one. So that's pretty cool. Um, sorry if the audio is a little weird. I didn't bring my microphone. Yeah. 